it's up to you. It's a problem. All right, yeah, I'll catch you later. I'm going to work. Yeah, see you, bro. All right. Well, guess I'm home now. What do you think I'm gonna hit on the bench today, man? Well, basically, right, there's gonna be 145 pound plate here, 145 pound plate here, a 25 pound plate. So that means 275, right? And it's gonna come down here, and then it's gonna be locked out here, right? 275 bench. I am going for a max today. He thinks I'm gonna hit 275. I haven't even really done bench for like two years, one and a half to two years. And last time I did, I tried for a one rep max, and I think I got 225. So we're gonna see what happens today. I'm with David and Dylan in New Jersey for the you know for the next week, so I'm just gonna go with what they're doing, and we're benching, so uh, we're gonna see what happens. First bench to abs. <laughs> What are you going what? for today, bro? I 250. Smell a two 250? Five and a zero, bro. I yeah. smell it. Go. Woo! You want two slaps? No. No? I wish I had liquid chalk. Fuck. Come on. 50, baby. Uh. Oh! Get it! Push, push! Got it. Fuck. Uh. Fuck. Way more fucking solid. Yeah. Easy. Way more solid. Hell yeah. Jesus Christ. Let's go. Whoa, one more. Let's go. Let's go, you can get it. Let's go. Your 245 is easy. Let's go. 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 Really? Okay guys, so it has been a few days since that bench session and actually the day before uh, I did that bench session, we were down in Atlantic City, me, in Atlantic City, me and Dave, and um, we actually lost my wallet. We were on a swing set. I have business cards in the wallet, so luckily someone emailed me and has the wallet and actually dropped it off at Dave's uh, restaurant. So here we are, Brittany's Cafe. We go eat and uh, get my wallet back hopefully. Oh my God. A lot of people, dude. Going? We, yeah, man. All right, so we've got the wallet back, right? Just went inside. Oh, no. We just got it. Now, moment of truth, we're going to open this wallet up and we're going to see if there's any cash left inside. Dude, yeah, this is the only time I've held a large sum of. Fuck you, open this wallet. Yeah, yeah it's like it should be it should be right where it's where it's not. They Are fucking you took the fucking cash, dude. Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah, took. Took, took all my cash. This has been the only time that I've carried a large sum of cash because just because I was traveling and I left it in my wallet. And uh, yeah, they fucking took it, man. I fucking took it. Just kidding. I, I really didn't take that. So yeah. fucked up. Yeah. Wow. Toss that. I got the short side. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Okay, guys. So basically, <laughs> Dave's on his booster board. I'm on this long board. God, and, you good? Yeah. And we have this cable. And so we're gonna see uh we're gonna see how this works. Is this gonna work? What? Yeah, I think so. I don't know. We got this. Well where are we going now, dude? Okay, I'm coming up on you, dude. Oh shit. Shit!
Did you leave me, sir? Dude, we're fucked, dude. I what? hope we have enough battery to make it back. Oh! So, what do you want me to do? You will not walk in that Apple store with your camera like this, literally telling everyone's happening very loud. I'm literally walk up to an Apple employee, put your arm around them, yo, what's up, brother? So guys, just like Dave said, well, he said I wasn't gonna do it, but I 100% am here at the Apple store, and um, yeah, I'm just gonna look for a computer. Huh, excuse me, sir. Um, you having a good day? I am. I'm having a great day? Awesome, I'm having a great day. Okay, cool. Yeah, well, I did it. Come on, rock, paper, scissors for the charger. No. Cornelius, do you want the rock, paper, scissors? I to wrestle for this charger. No, I'm kidding. All right, I. You saw that? Wait, I won. Again. Wait, what? I won. All right. All right, that's one. one. That's one. What? Yeah. Dude, Are you're mad? so annoying. Are you mad? Are you his dad? I'm, you see this hat? He got it for me for Father's Day. <laughs> Literally. I got the found Father's Day for my son. Oh, like the shh. And the clean, and what else was there? You know how the what else was there? You know how the, literally, here's how the shit started. I was in my, like, waking up, I was eating breakfast, and all of a sudden, I would just, like, come, I was like, shit, 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 and, like, and my mom was like, what the fuck, you're saying that a lot. So I picked up Dylan, we went to Sam's house, I kept saying it, then he started saying that. I think that. we were it both became... in a bad mood, we were both just like, we were literally just sitting in the car, like, shit, shit. shit. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, we were like all pissed off. And and then by the end of the day, way. we told her the least like 1,500 shits. Yeah. Sounded right every time it was said. And then I said it, remember, and then I just said it in like the shh. Yeah. Sh what? People try to, they always come up to me and they try to say it, but like, if the first person who comes up to me and properly says it, I'm gonna literally give them a whole entire year's worth of Gymshark clothing. All my supply, I'm giving it to them. <laughs> People do it like, they're like, shit. And I'm like, oh, oh my God. Like, dude, I was walking in my car once at Island Gym. Like, I'm literally just like walking in my car. Like, I'm like, oh, like, and then they're like, they're like, literally this kid literally walks up to me. He's like, like, he's like, like, shit. And I'm like, oh my God. I was like, I was like, wait, like, what? Like, he's like, oh, shit. And I was like, oh, all right. Like, <laughs> I, I got really scared. I ran in my car. Yeah, what's in the description? What's in the description of the video? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Ryan's Gymshark link may or may not be in the description of this video. And if you did want to purchase any Gymshark clothes, like this hoodie right here, we're not saying to click that link. But if you did want to buy any Gymshark clothing, you could click it. you wanted it. a hoodie that and looks just like that. It would want, work. And you, and you it needed a work. link to yeah. get to a website that can yeah. sell you that hoodie, it may or not, it may or may not be the first link in the description box yeah. of this video. I'm that will saying. get you that those clothes, yes. Look how short I am compared to you. Oh my god. He's got <laughs> <laughs> Wait, now you're holding down like extra tall. This is terrible. Is that your little cock over there, dude? You're not going to be so short like that, dude. Just to let you guys know, I'm actually like 5'9". So. The only thing that belongs to Ryan that I'm holding right now is this gorilla pod and his SD card. He's currently borrowing my 70 because I was going to- Don't tell them the secret! Oh, I, 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 never mind, like, yeah. <laughs> Thing, shit. <laughs> yeah, uh, today I'm going to the gym, right? I'm hitting 550 for five on the deadlift. Dave is gonna hit. What do you hit on the deadlift, Dave? 549. He's gonna hit probably around 500, right? He's Dude. probably gonna fail like his fourth rep. So I mean, I'm gonna pull it out today with the victory. We're, we're back on the sumo deadlift war again. So yeah, we'll see. And I'll just uh, I'll just be spectating sadly because uh, you know well, I don't. Join us next time. I'll join you guys. I'm gonna join him next time though. You said no straps. What what I say about straps? You said no straps. No right? strap ons. That's oh, strap on? Said. I mean, Ryan said no straps. That's he what said I heard. Strap on. No, he did say that, but before that, he said no straps. I heard conventional. So basically, everyone's in the gym right now hitting deadlifts. I think everyone started sumo again today. And obviously, as you guys have seen on my channel, I don't really deadlift at all. So right now, I'm actually not going to deadlift. The next time they do deadlift, the next time I'm here, I'm definitely going to come back and uh, do deadlifts with them because I'm actually starting a program when I go back home. And just seeing them coming in the gym and taking everything extremely serious with their programming has really motivated me to maybe get on the program and you know start my own you know strength training. You know, because everything I've already done, you know, my whole life of training has all been hypertrophy. So. I don't know. Oh, 
Why is it hard for it to go there again? Okay, so we got back home. The back workout was subpar. I mean, it was a really, really good pump, but the gym closed really early since it's Sunday. So we kind of had to just kind of get through it and film a few sets of each exercise and then just kind of leave. Right now, everyone's outside just playing badminton. So I just wanted to film this clip. We're gonna play badminton and then I don't really know what we're gonna do next. But uh, yeah, so uh, let's, let's see some badminton action. I'd say he's made the amount of gains that a grown, healthy adult male, grown, healthy made, adult elephant, yes, yeah. would have made in roughly a year and a half. So, I personally can't comprehend that. He has um, some world class genetics, and he's made some outrageous gains. What do you think? Feels good to be home, bro. Dude, you're only here for like a week. What are you, what are you talking about? 